Sterling Hall make sure that we know every single boy really, really well. How do we multiply fractions? Very good. They're so inquisitive. Grade five boys are constantly asking questions. They want to know what's going on around them. They want to research. They want to make presentations. They love to stand up and share what they've learned. They love working in groups, sharing with one another. It's debate. It's phenomenal. Are you keeping these for your notes? Yeah. Okay. So I try my best to uh, make things exciting, uh, keep things moving, keep, uh, keep them engaged, um, do things together. So far recently we've been learning about like measuring like the 3D shapes and, like surface area, area, like perimeter and stuff and the multiplying, dividing and adding and subtracting fractions is also pretty tricky and like it's cool. We'll be learning about fractions or learning about you know factors and they'll be wanting to know why do we need to know this? Where are we going to use this in the real world? How is this done around us? And it's making that explanation, trying to explain to them there's context to what they're learning. With a small class size, I can make sure that I pay attention to every single boy, his learning style. If he's struggling with something, I have time to really help him. And if a boy is very advanced, I also have the time, resources, energy to give them extension activities so that teaching each learner exactly how they learn and exactly what they need. I like social studies because we do lots of projects on stuff we want to learn on. I really enjoy doing Hamlet because it's a good opportunity for us to learn Shakespeare in like a young age to do Shakespeare right now. I like it because we uh, we just got to do a play in like uh, 60 seconds of the play uh, so we had to do it really quickly and that, I thought that was really fun. Um, I like uh, novel studies like reading books that we do in class and stuff. Boys love challenge. If you challenge boys, they'll pick it up and they'll run with it. That challenge also plays into uh, games and activities in the classroom where rather than just making the assignment, it's about making it into a game, making it into a challenge, making it something that they can try to be inherently boy with and it really helps them to learn better. Mm -hmm.